Hi YouTubers, welcome to Coin Dawn. It's been some time since I posted my last video. There are two very interesting things about this video. First, it's you can hear my voice. The audio is there. Secondly, I'm going to be doing something very special, and that is unboxing. I'm going to be unboxing some precious treasures here which are more than a hundred years old yes they are coins from the Meiji period in Japan and I got them from a very interesting character in Saitama prefecture he was an old farmer who apparently uncovered these hot coins in his farmhouse well before I open Please press the like, subscribe and share buttons and please feel free to send your comments. Alright, here we go. Ja -ja wow, look at this bag. It's cute, isn't it? Alright, now let's see what's in the bag. Look at this, that's so much of platina on the coins and look at them, probably they have not been touched for the past 50 or 70 years. Alright, look at them, they have different sizes, these are the two and the half sen. By the way, the Meiji period was from 1868 to 1912. The Meiji period started just after the Edo period, which was the feudal Japan. The Meiji emperor was Matsuhito, a very interesting personality. And during those period, the coins, the smaller ones at least, were known as Sen. That's right, S-E-N, Sen. You don't have that now in Japan, but during that period, yes, are Sen. The bigger ones here, these are the two and the half sen. And the slightly smaller ones here, these are the one sen. And the small ones here, these are the half sen. You saw the coins? Later, we will zoom and show you the coins. And for the smaller ones, the half sand, they were copper, they were about three and a half grams or so, and they were about 22 millimeters in size. All of these coins are more than a hundred years old. Can you imagine the kind of history we are holding here and what these coins would have went through? Like this two and a half sand could have bought a lot of things in Japan back in the 1800s. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to arrange these coins and then I'll show them this, show these coins to you. Alright, now all the coins have been sorted out. Here you have the two and a half sen, and here you have the one sen, and this is the half sen. And it is S E N sen, it's not cent. Okay, so these were the type of uh, coins or denominations used during this period. Alright, so this is a two and a half cent and it is 
this is the front of the coin if you see you can see a dragon there and the year of the coin was Meiji 10 that's how they referred to the coins so it was Meiji 10 that is the 10th year of Emperor Matsuhito and Meiji 10 translated into uh, the Western calendar it's 1877 boy is a pretty old coin during 1877 with two and a half cent in your pocket I think you're a happy guy you can buy lots of things all right and this is the front and the back of the coin all right or rather this is the yeah this is the back of the coin and here you would find some writings and it's basically telling you it's two and a half cent and also you have these uh, flowers here very beautiful flowers and also this coin was about 14.3 or 14.5 grams smooth rim the rims are very smooth that's these coins should not have any other rims except smooth rims and then they were about 31.5 or 31.8 thick millimeters all right so this is basically a very beautiful old coin still in nice condition and this is the and now these are the one sen sen if you look at the back you'll find the same meiji dragon they were sometimes known as the, as the dragon coins all right and then you will also find um, some writings here in japanese those are basically indicating to you that this coin is of meiji year nine yes that's the reign of the emperor his ninth year of reign so in english calendar or western calendar it is 1876 another really old coin in pretty good condition and in the front you'll find the flowers and it, it says one cent here and again the rims the rim is very smooth just like the two cent coin this one cent coin has a smooth rim and it is about 7.13 7.15 grams and it's copper also the thickness is about 27 28 millimeters beautiful coin then this is a half cent coin the back is the same it has the dragon and in japanese characters it's uh, meiji year 17 yes year 17 is 1884 in western calendar and material it's um, made of copper it's about 3.5 3.56 grams and it's about 22 millimeters thick this coin is also in pretty good shape so yeah they were used to buy some small ticket items like sweets and candies and maybe some small groceries during that time but the irony is can you see even a half cent coin was made out of copper if you look at current japanese one yen that is made from aluminium so in in some ways the money was much bigger that time i guess you can buy more things 
with your money. You don't get to see these coins in modern day Japan. They do not have the sen. All right, I think their lowest denomination is one yen. But back in the 1800s, you had half sen, one sen, and even two and a half sen. All right, so they are really beautiful coins. I will put up more videos for you, uh, not only on reading the Japanese coin, but um, identifying which coins have a lower mintage and which coins are more valuable. So please press the like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop me a like. Thank you so much. Until my next video, have fun. The next video is also going to be an unboxing video. So please stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. Thank you once again.